Hi, good thing. Hello. Hi. So this is the link. I'm flying dark because no invite. We have no invite. Still, no. Oh, but I I explicitly sent it to you. I got yeah, it. it explicitly did not uh, reach me. This is really weird. It is never. Uh, I don't know what's happening here. <laughs> I get other invites uh, though. <laughs> put me in your spam folder. Yeah, no, it's not that easy. <laughs> See, look here. See, it says here. Look, look. I mean, I actually took out because I was tired of. I took the uh, the list out because I was tired of getting no thank yous from all sorts of people. It says right here. <laughs> Says your name right here. Yeah, I believe you. Darn. I should add you to my contacts. Maybe that'll make the difference. Anyway, Dave, thank you for the pull requests. And I think Hank went through them as well. I don't know who did what actually now. Who did what? Dave did both pull requests and Hank has reviewed them. Uh, I hope this is our last meeting today. That would be great. Yeah, I think we're pretty close, pretty much at that point. Uh, Andrew. So how did you know to show up, Hank, if, 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 uh, you didn't get an invite. Uh, poor memory. But oh, wow. sufficient memory, I guess. You actually remember to come. OK. As a data point, I actually got an invite. See, Hank? I know. It's me. It's not you, probably. Well, but it's very annoying because I, I feel like calendaring, you know, which was already not great, is getting like s somehow worse. So just give it another minute. I, I assume, you know, we're going to have Ned and. It's a legit it's an assumption, I think. Oh? No, it is not. Ned will not be here. Uh, I think he highlighted that he will be out today and blocked for most of the day. And that included an earlier meeting and therefore also this one here. Way. Hello, Way. Oh, Banco. All right. Well, we have a we're missing one author, but that's all. So, and I you say Hank Ned might not make it. So let's just get into this. So, uh, intro to add intro to Appendix A, and that's our paragraph. Is that enough? I think so. Well, I see uh, Hank. You filed the issue, and you and you approved it. So. Hank, are you speaking? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay. trying to, yeah, yeah, so yeah, okay. I, I approve this apparently, so okay. uh, I, I'm fine. <laughs> okay, I just wasn't sure. I, I saw the bubble around your name, but it didn't, there were no words that came out. Okay, reference trust anchor store and relying party section. Uh, here, both Hank and Thomas commented on it with suggested changes. I made those changes and I I don't know if they both approved it after I made the changes this morning. Uh, I did, but uh, I, yeah, I, so had, I hadn't seen the, back to it yet. Yeah, so, I haven't yeah. seen that. Hadn't seen the changes. I hadn't seen the pre-changes, the before changes. So gotcha. Yeah. Uh, Tom, yeah Tom so he got here. Stuff. He hasn't checked it afterwards, but yeah. So, so I did what he said. Great. 
And separately, by the way, both Thomas and Hank's comments uh, applied to the TEEP architecture document too. And I also have the same outstanding pull request on the TEEP architecture documents to be uh, merged there. Wow, that's efficient. Two documents with one pull request. No, 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 no. Two, two, two pull requests for the same comments because the text was copied, and so it actually applies to both documents. Both I get it. I, I get comments. it. I get it. There's a parable. There's yeah. a parable about a tailor and six and six flies. I don't know if you know that parable. Not off the top of my head. Of no. It's it's from Grimm, and it's seven yeah. flies. But yes, seven flies. Oh, yeah, seven flies. Yes, he, hit, he killed seven flies with with one smack of his belt. He put that in his belt. And then as it in adventures, everyone assumed that he meant seven men. Okay. Yeah. Um, I, yeah. I, 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 I know what you're referring to now. Uh, actually, Disney did a takeoff on that where yes. uh, Mickey Mouse was playing that character. That's right. Yeah, and, and he killed right. like seven flies with a fly swatter or something is the, the, the uh, Disney edit. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. All right. So basically, partly what's happened is the text has moved up from here to here. Yep. And then we have this additional uh, piece down here, which looked perfectly great to me. Yep. And he, the, the, the and main just... point of the issue that was filed was that the same issues apply to the relying party, but the relying party section just didn't happen to use trust anchor before it used other text. Uh, even though the same thing applied. And so we moved it up to the first location and made it actually use the term trust anchor for the stuff it was talking about. That was what the original issue was. So Yeah, and that's where that's the new text here is yep. expressed yep. by storing that in the trust anchor. Okay, so I'm going to hit the merge button. The only thing that's remaining is the this issue that Lawrence had filed some time ago and which... We have not liked the rewording, and Lawrence has not not atta been attached to this wording, but none of us have seen to uh, mm -hmm. decide we want to fix his wording. Um, I didn't have any great strong preference for the for for the new wording over the old wording myself, so it wasn't. Uh, and probably, you know, some of us see trust anchors in here. Maybe some of this has all just changed at this point. And we should just we should just close it as unfixed. Um, as, a, as a reference point, uh, about a fortnight ago, Lawrence added a layered attestation text as a proposal to his EAT ID, and I actually think that's that's relatively good. I commented on it uh, like a few hours ago, and mm -hmm. um, having in mind our current and not this proposed text about layer attestation, the text that he introduced in, uh, in the EAT ID uh, works actually quite well with our existing text. And, and, and this proposal uh, is, is, of course, a rewording, but uh, it is not required by the EAT ID uh, to make sense, because I think that already makes sense. So, so that's just a point of reference and a single opinion about the dependencies here. So this proposal here in this uh, uh, PR is not a prerequisite for the each ID to make sense, I think. So I would propose that we're going to mark this as won't fix and that essentially the world has moved on. I would agree with that. Sounds like, Hank, you can support that. Yeah, I can support that. I. I, I hope to, uh, is the other author on the call or the other editor on the call? Are you okay with that way? You might be on mute. Or... Okay. Oh. But he's also mobile. Maybe he's. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. Noisy okay. location. <laughs> yeah, I think he's. Right. Uh, it's quite late there too, so he may not be able to unmute. You can type, maybe. I don't know. Okay, so oh. we're going to uh, close this. Um, uh, existing text is compatible with current eat ID text. Closing 
uh, you also mention when you say existing text, you might say current updated text or you know current text. I don't know something that implies that the text that he's quoting in the in the issue is no longer the exact text. So I don't, I don't know how you would say it. So. Yeah, there you go. Okay. I think there is. Was there an was, attached it issue? It was attached pull request. I'm sorry, a pull request and issue were both in there. Yeah. Uh, so this was the this was the uh, issue. Was it though? Um, I try to. I think this is somehow slightly different. Just keep scrolling down. I want to see where the conversation ended here because I don't remember. Well, that's this comment. Yeah. And who's coming to? Who's the name on the one just above? Is that you, Michael? The, the, rather than okay. It says we shall add note to the effect that the diagram is a conceptual flow of how the trust is conveyed, not how David is physically transmitted. Did we do that? Yes. Didn't okay. we? That's what I'm asking. Um, because it's not tagged uh, as referencing okay. this issue. If we did so, if yeah, if we did it, we should actually add a note that it was in a particular pull request. Yeah, okay. Um, so I'll have to look at the text and I need to probably need to format it. So I'll leave this open, this point here open to be closed. Uh, quote, reply. Okay, so. Um. Yes, Dave. No, I, I, I'm looking at the document itself just in case I can find it. Okay. Way. Oh, okay. I, I just assumed I couldn't find it quickly until um, I reformat it. The closest thing that I can find in the one minute that I spent looking for it is in the paragraph that's in the conceptual messages section. And I'm wondering when that was added. I can track it to a particular pull request. Okay. You added it in that pull request. Let's see if I can find that. Sorry, in that commit. Try uh, for request three three three. For request three three three, paragraph starting line nine seven five. Specifically, line 977, I think, is the closest I can find to that point. Okay. But that um, one, it, it doesn't actually explicitly call it out, the fact that it might be part, you know, it might flow through some other entity or whatever, which was the point that you'd summarize there. That's the closest thing. But you can see 977 only talks about format and semantics. It doesn't talk about... Um, Trust. Which yeah, well, it doesn't talk talk about which entities are like intermediaries or something in the in, in the middle of an end end uh, uh, 
Uh, okay, so well. you think that's enough to put to to? Put... I, I don't know. I was looking to see if we'd actually put your main point there, and I could find something that was close. It doesn't actually make your point. It it not, at least that paragraph doesn't. But you could easily add a sentence if you wanted to. Uh, say pretty much what you said in your comment by putting in a sentence into that paragraph okay I'll, someplace I'll, else in the doc so i, I, I will i will read it again and and in, in its full glory and okay. figure out whether or not i think we need to add something else to there okay um that way i think that okay so you have an action item but hopefully we can do it without any meeting yeah i think so yeah okay so i'm gonna put okay. i'm gonna going to format revision 12 and i'll mm -hmm. just read it before i uh post it to see if if i want to add a sentence um and uh but i don't think so i think i'm happy with the tenses as it is I, i'm happy maybe you're not but i'm happy <laughs> well i didn't file the issue so i uh, yeah but i didn't I, i'm happy to go along with whatever you guys think so uh so so i didn't file this issue either um but i thought that that was resolving part of it um so i think this last issue uh if you decide michael so so i would be fine with the current set if you decide that there is still a, a sentence would not hurt and we can uh, uh discuss this uh, via email then we can resolve that via email i think and then have a blank slate on the issue tracker uh, we don't have to schedule another meeting, which mm -hmm. I hope really to avoid, actually. And I, although I like talking and working with you, <laughs> so it's not that. But um, but um, then we uh, then I can approach the chairs for next steps. Well, we're yeah. So this is our our yeah. So the, the, this is our our resolution of working group last call issues. Uh, so they just need to yeah. And I know Kathleen was the shepherd. And she had comments, and we dealt with her comments. So I think mechanically, it's just the next step. All right. So I know I'm just noticing, I'm paging in state here, right? The comment that you made here is in response to Peng Lin, right? Not uh, Lawrence. And if you remember, Peng Lin's comment was the layered attestation diagram has a line coming out of the bootloader and going to the verifier. Yep. And uh, really what happens, as you point out, is, well, it generates something that might be, you know, stored or passed up or whatever, and some other entity that uh, doesn't have access to the keys can take that blob and send it off to the verifier. Right? So the, the bootloader doesn't actually speak the protocol per se, right? It's just yeah. the originating the message, if you will, right? And somebody else has to put that message into a protocol. Uh, so, so one of he said somewhere. So one of the possibilities. Let me just change this. To... And so I was looking in the wrong place for the the point because I was thinking this is in response to Lawrence. So. So there might also be someplace else. So, um, so, yeah. yeah. And if remember, we had talked about whether the line that comes horizontally out of a testing environment, whether that should come up through the kernel. And you guys all said, no, let's not do that because that would be confusing to have it come out of a testing environment, go upwards, and then to the right as it passes through kernel. So, what if the line came from the outer box, like this? um i don't i or, think it would be confusing i think it has to or like that i think it has to come from the testing environment so right. there. That, so that's how what i was originally before. wondered was yeah. whether the line came out of that testing environment at the top side went upwards through the middle of the kernel and continued on to, and then went over to the verifier yeah all right that's yeah, what i had originally asked and it sounded like other people didn't like that idea so yeah, although I agree that that's the technical direction of, of it, I prefer I prefer that 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 we're showing the path of the the, the uh, signed system. objects, the artifacts, yeah. rather than than how they get places. Because yep. um, I was convinced, so I, I was yeah. not going to press the issue. So I'm just saying I've, I'm now paging in state that this was the discussion that we all had and came to that agreement last time. Yeah. But okay. uh, what I don't know is if we put in any text that actually said that, or if we just leave it as implied. Uh, I think we just let, let's just let it be. I think uh -huh. we should just let it be. If we get further reviews that are confused by this, then we could add some text. But I think it's better to let, I think we should, I think we should leave it. I think it's, it's better to have the person who then says, uh, I don't understand 
figure out whether we're made that made them happy and mm -hmm. rather than dealing okay. with a person we don't know okay sounds fine to me okay all right so i'm going to post number 12 and i think we're done for the day all right So just just for my my housekeeping, um, would it be that we were addressing the output from the working group last call started last October? Is that the thing? Yeah. Wow. Okay. That took its sweet time. Um, well, <laughs> uh, then oh. we are done with that task finally. And uh, yeah, are you okay with me? approaching the chairs and asking for next steps yeah yeah absolutely that's okay. what so, someone needs to do that yeah well, well we it would looks like ned the, to do that if ned was here uh it looks like the circle ci <laughs> actually oh, it looks like the circle ci actually did the posting for us which was confusing to me because it's never worked before oh, i put yeah. the tag i put the tag on it i pushed the tag and then i tried to submit and it said i've already submitted version 12 and i went huh But, it may be because of the fix that Thomas uh, Fossati pushed. Uh, he just pushed the uh, the, the XML to RFC formatter uh, fix. If you look in one of the two issues we just merged, he commented on that and pointed to the commit, which had that fix. It uh, should be. Way, but he, he, he fixed it. Could be. Anyway, I, I, I mean, I've just never seen it work like that and somebody did somebody approve the post the the yes. you 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 approved it okay i see all right that's uh, why i was like but how did it get in the data tracker not, not <laughs> like going, works. that's why i was like that's why i was a little bit like huh but i but and then okay all right so it's there all right and uh uh we have a diff i already got the diff there's the diff all right, great. Okay, well, it's been a long, strange trip. <laughs> uh, yeah, all right. Yeah, thank you, everybody. This was uh, fun, and this is actually a rock solid uh, document. One of the better ones, to keep it mildly, I think. Yeah. So, uh, thanks. Now we gotta wait for Roman to beat us up on it. Okay. <laughs> Okay. All right. Thank you very much, everyone. Bye-bye.